All right, guys, today the Hi-Fi Air, a pair of earbuds from Fiti. These guys are under the umbrella of Mifo. You have seen a bunch of their videos on my channel. These are a little bit more friendly when it comes to price. 50 bucks for these, and right now, 20% off. I'll drop the links below and a coupon code to get you that 20% off. But let's take a look and check out the Hi-Fi Air. A and C, transparency mode, a low latency mode, two mics on each earbud. The Fiti, picture of the bud, stem style buds, you can see here exactly what they look like. And on the back, it does tell us a little bit more about the specs on here. Bluetooth 5.2, ANC and ENC for voice calls. There is a low latency mode. This is also IPX7 waterproof. So we are getting a lot for our money, but what we are not getting inside of the box is a charging cable. And these are not wireless charging compatible. So no cable and no wireless charging. Just be aware, you're not getting a cable, and this is becoming a trend, and I, for one, am not a fan of that trend. Now, speaking of battery life, you're going to get about five and a half hours of battery life with a total of about 36 hours with the case, depending on how loud you listen to. You might get five, you might get six, depends on the volume of these earbuds. Now, the only things that do come in the case, we get small, medium, and large silicone tips, user's manual, and, well, paperwork that nobody cares about. Now, the actual earbuds in the case, you can see on the front, we do have three LED lights here on the front. If we can get them to come on, there they are. So three LED lights. And if we open it up, stem style earbuds, that black finish on there with the branding here on the front. VT on the front. I don't mind the case at all. Not bad. Take these earbuds out. You guys can get a closer look. So a very small stem on here. So I don't know if you like stem or you don't. But I don't mind them at all. A lot of times we get really good phone calls with stem style earbuds. And these actually are no different. The phone call and the phone call quality on here, I, you know, I think they punch above the price point of these earbuds. Now, let's just start with the mic test. All right, now to look in the feel of these earbuds as we do the mic test. You can see here how they look again, small stems on these earbuds. They're very lightweight, so you're going to be able to wear these all day long if they do fit and they are waterproof so if you want to work out and then you can go ahead and do that but the mics on here let me know what you think two mics on each ear but enc so it will drown out some of the outside noise and give you a clearer phone call but let me know drop some comments below all right guys so touch controls on these earbuds very simple to use it's all tap to touch and we have everything so we have volume up volume down in and out of ANC, two different levels of ANC. We so we have a mild ANC, and we also have a stronger ANC, which is only up to about 35 decibels. So we're still talking about kind of entry level to mid range when it comes to the quality of the ANC on these earbuds. And we'll talk about ANC and transparency mode in a minute. Now you can also go into low latency mode on here with five taps. So you're using everything. Next track, previous track, you have everything on a pair of earbuds. I don't know why every company just doesn't offer this. I hate when they skimp out on the touch controls because this is what I want. If I'm at the gym working out or something, I don't want to pull up my phone. I want to do everything from the earbud. And they did that here. So well done. Now let's talk about the ANC and the transparency mode on these earbuds. So with the price point of these earbuds, we are getting exactly, well, what they cost. We're getting kind of entry level ANC, two different modes. The mild mode is, is not that good. The stronger mode, that's where you're going to want to leave it. It does a decent job of blocking out, you know, the low rumbles, the ACs, the car engines, things like that. Any voices or anything like that, you are still going to hear. Conversations, you are still going to hear. The ANC is decent, not that great. And the transparency mode, basically the same thing. Not very strong at all. It's natural sounding. It's just not strong in my opinion. Again, entry level when it comes to transparency mode. Now, now when it comes to latency and delay on these earbuds, watching content, you're going to be good. No issues with that. But gaming, some of the heavier games, you might notice a little delay. But the low latency mode on here for the price does a really good job. So Call of Duty, I really didn't have any problems with delay between audio and video. So not bad at all for the price. All right, guys, sound quality and the volume on these earbuds. So volume wise, I need more. It's really that simple. I need more. You guys know how I roll with volume. I like to dial it way up, bring it back a little bit, find that sweet spot, and then we roll from there. These, I need more. 
pretty much all the time. Like I can max these out and have no issues and still find myself wanting more. So I am disappointed with how loud these get. Now, sound quality on here, they're clean, they're crisp, they're warm, very good detail on here, but these are not bass head certified. So if you like that bass, if you like that thump, these are not the earbuds for you. If you like a more balanced sound, a cleaner sound, then you might like these earbuds. The problem for me with these earbuds is the volume. It comes down to that, like for the price, we're getting a lot, right? We're getting IPX7 waterproof. The mics on here, I think they did a good job with the mics, the low latency mode on here, full touch controls. Now, no app, no customizable touch controls, which you don't need anyway, because you get everything. ANC, which is decent. Transparency mode, which is a little less than decent. But the, the sound quality and the volume, you guys know what kind of music I like, right? I like some bass. These are a little bit lacking in the bass and for me lacking in the volume. But, you know, if you don't like your music too loud, you might like these. And if you like that clean sound, that more balanced sound, then you might like these. They, they're very detailed, they're very clean and very crisp, just not bass head certified. Now, saying bass head certified doesn't mean that that sounds better. That's just what I gravitate towards. So you might like these. Let me know, drop some comments and let me know what type of music you like because you all know if you follow the channel, what type of music I like. But that's it guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that like, drop a sub, and I'll be back soon. Not bad though for, you know, with 20% off, you're gonna get these for around 40 bucks. So not bad still. Peace guys.